New tonight, parents believe their kids could be in danger because of where their school buses are picking them up. Our Emily Longnecker has their concerns, plus why the district says this bus stop change was not up to them. These students with Warren Township schools are all smiles getting off the bus on 21st Street in front of the Warren Harbor apartments where they live. Some of their parents, though, aren't happy because of where you see the bus dropping them off. They stop coming in. They stop Parents driving. like Kara Bingham are worried about safety now that the buses don't drive into the apartment complex, stopping instead right outside along a busy road. Bingham is concerned about her six-year-old son. When he get off the bus, the first thing he do, he just run across the street. He don't look both ways. Eyewitness News watched as one bus let kids off just like Bingham described. Another one, though, drove inside the gates. It was the same story just down the street at Lakeview Terrace. The bus stop used to be on every corner through the um, complex, um, so they will come in and get them, but this year they changed it to the front. A district spokesperson said they service 32 apartment complexes in the area. They said this year of that 32, only three apartment complexes gave them permission to come on property. And they said the reason the complex is cited were that the buses tore up their infrastructure. So those are the winter tear up the streets. It ain't just the school buses or vehicles. Bridget Vincent's eight-year-old daughter isn't affected because she's visually impaired. Buses for students with special needs will still come inside apartment complexes, but Vincent still worries that other students are in danger. Well, I prefer y'all to not put these kids on their busy street because there's unsafe drivers. And what about in the winter time when it's dark outside? You're going to have little kids standing out on the busy roads. Julie Spear with Lakeview Terrace says she's heard from several parents about the change. Nobody wants the kids out on those busy roads. Yeah. None of us do. But the district says the change wasn't up to them. Oh, yeah. Emily Longnecker, Channel 13, Eyewitness News.